Well, the next time you're in downtown West Palm Beach, you'll probably see them, the new solar-powered parking meters. And before the city has installed all of them, these so-called smart meters are coming under scrutiny. News Channel 5's Katie Johnson live downtown. So, Katie, what's the main complaint? Well, typically when you park downtown, you can use nearly every coin that's in your wallet. Now you might want to leave those nickels and dimes behind. These new meters only taking quarters and dollar coins. And let's face it, not everybody carries around those dollar coins. Robert Norville likes to grab a cup of coffee before he goes to work each morning. He's used to feeding the meter to pay for his time, but today he noticed something different. So I went to put in, you know, just a nickel and a dime for two minutes, three minutes to run in, and now the meters only take quarters and dollar coins. A change you'll now notice downtown too. These solar powered meters meant to save money for the city will require you to fork out bigger coins, taking only quarters and dollar coins. Last time I checked, I do not have a Sacagawea in my pocket or a Susan B. Anthony. The machines also take credit cards or you can pay with an app. But if you want to use your card, you must pay a minimum of a dollar, a small amount some don't want to put on their credit card. The minimum is a dollar. It's no good. I mean, why should you put that on a credit card? The city is installing a total of 1,000 new meters across the downtown area and city place, a move that's forcing some local business owners to stock up on quarters to help customers pay to park. If you don't have nickels and dimes, now you got to go trade in your nickels and dimes into um, a restaurant to get a quarter for it. Now the city stresses it's not raising parking rates to cover the $500,000 cost of all these new meters, but a spokesman does tell me that they won't be considering changing the type of coins that these meters process because only by taking these two coins, a dollar and quarter coins, this helps save the city time and money. Live in downtown West Palm Beach, Katie Johnson, WPTV News Channel 5.